In this video, I will go over how to create a simple phone or tablet uh, stand. Um, I'm not exactly going over the design process, but uh, tips in making one, you know, how to go about it basically. Uh, so here I just import this model uh, and I'm just going to click import model. Uh, I got this model from uh, Thingiverse. Uh, it's a free place to download 3D models and I just typed in iPhone case uh, to import them. You just go to insert and then just add and load object or load uh, image. I think that's what it is in here. So here I have this and this is actually in two pieces so I'm just going to select all group and again I am just using this as a reference um, I have you know exact proportions to the uh, to an iPhone or whatever model this one was um, but it's general size for any smartphone at least uh, so here I have this and I just angled it if I want to be exact with my angle I can always type in 45 and that's kind of like a general uh, angle for stands um, but maybe I want it taller I mean obviously this is probably not going to be a good idea something like that maybe but I'll just leave it at that uh, next I'm just gonna you know, go to cube I'll just use this uh, and then from here Maybe I don't like this, maybe I can go with something different, a hexagon, and I'll just bring this in, whoops, uh, there is such a thing as too thin and too thick of course, just like any other thing we've done here, maybe I want to stretch this out a little bit, uh, go over here, go over here, um, I want to be aware of my uh, symmetry, um, maybe something like this, I don't know. Uh, you want to avoid having something like this because then it's just going to tip over. So maybe something like this. And, you know, of course it's, it's, up, to, it's up to the kid, it's up to you. I'm not a designer, but... You just want to be aware of those things, and then maybe I want something right here, so I'll use maybe a wedge. I'll click and drag that on top. Maybe I'll place this right here, something like that, I suppose. Uh, kind of align it to it here, and just to make sure. I'm just looking, yep, everything is snapped. Maybe I'll make this a little bit taller, maybe make this a little bit thinner, things like that. But I'll just do something like this. And to keep it easier for my eyes at least, I'm gonna change the colors to make sure that they match. So that looks good. And then maybe here, I'm just gonna actually, I'm gonna group them. And then here, I'm just gonna go to edit, emboss. I can, you know, type in whatever, you know, text I want. Uh, you know, type in whatever, something, I don't know. No idea. Or I can add, uh, maybe, maybe I'll add a picture. Um, let's go with the happy face, I guess. So here I have this. Scale it up. Maybe I want to stick out like that. That's uh, much different than what it looked like, but yeah, well, there you go. I have something like that. And then for this part back here, maybe, maybe I'll go with a. Uh, cylinder like maybe use multiple cylinders or maybe go with another hexagon um, 
pyramid. I don't know about that. I'll just stick with the cube. So I'm just going to move this, kind of get a general idea how I want it to be. Something like this. Something like that. Again, pay attention to the symmetry on that. Um, you know, maybe uh, this is going to stick out like this. Let me do, whoops, let me be symmetrical, something, uh, something like that. Maybe I want this, uh, maybe I want this to be like a container for some things. So here I have this, I'm just going to duplicate this, move it over here, maybe do like an L shape and then scale it in, stretch it up, making sure that it's not too thin, not too thick. I'm not too worried about the bottom part because I have I already have this anyways. And then from here, um, I'm just gonna do something like this. I don't know. I'll leave it at that, and then I'm just going to subtract, so have something like this, and maybe I'll undo that, and if I want this to be a container, I should uh, have, whoops, something over here on this side, so maybe something like this, whoops. Again, be symmetrical, it helps. Uh, I'm not doing that here. Uh, this here, just to, I, uh, had, I left this a little bit thicker just for some added weight. Um, again, it's up to you to decide how much. And, you know, I have something like this. I have, you know, that there. I can, uh, Add some form of text here if I wanted to, or you know, do whatever, or maybe I wanted a hole to be here. Uh, maybe add a a hole here for some cable to go through, things like that. But yeah, there you go.